Hi there, welcome again to Ancient Tales for Today. In the last few ancient tales, we've been looking at uh, a very strong man who was a leader and he did a lot for 20 years, but in the end he made a mistake and he lost his strength and so how did his life end? In today's chapter, number 78, chapter 78, this will end the story of Samson. And the title is Bringing the House Down. So stay by as we listen to the story being read first. And then we'll come back and explain it sentence by sentence. Story 78, Bringing the House Down. Last time we left Samson, the strong man, captured and blinded in a Philistine prison. This was a sad consequence for a man who had been such a leader of his people. This great man had been conquered, betrayed by a woman. But this was not the end for Samson. Well, not quite. While he was there in prison, he asked for one last favor from heaven. He had let his God and his people down. Samson realized that though his time was over and he had made many mistakes, he wanted one last chance to do something for his people. He prayed that his strength would return for one last act. Samson was given this last request. His strength returned, though none of the Philistines knew this. They planned a great celebration in their temple to thank their God that Samson had been captured. This was to be a wonderful day to show off their enemy, who was now blind and in their prison. That day, many Philistines came to celebrate their victory. They teased Samson that he wasn't able to do anything anymore. He couldn't even see where he was going. They weren't afraid of this enemy anymore. But Samson asked to be placed beside the pillars holding up the temple. In one last act of incredible strength, he pushed against those pillars and brought the roof crushing down on everyone. The ancient tales record that Samson killed more of his enemies at his death than when he was alive. What do we learn from all of this? It is a sad story, but there is much to learn. I would conclude like this. Point one, that to trust in our own strength is not enough. Point two, that we must be true to the path of right. And point three, that even in defeat, we can still have victory if we trust the God of heaven. Well, the last time we left Samson, the strong man was captured and blinded and in a Philistine prison. prison. Now that's not all that cool because he had been such a powerful man. He had done so many good things and protected his people for 20 years, but now he is captured. 已经被非利士人捉拿的, uh, okay? And he was blinded. 他们都下了他的双眼, uh, so now he cannot see, 看不见, and he is in a prison. 
非利士人的这个监狱。Now this is a sad consequence for a man who had been such a leader. 他是做多么好的一个领袖啊 ！For his people, 他的子民呢、啊、？But now we see this, and we said the way I wrote it here is, this is a sad consequence. Sad, ah,、uh, 悲惨。Okay, you can say it just like that. 悲惨的这个后果。Tragic, you could say, tragic consequence for a man who had been a really quite a great leader. This great man had been conquered and betrayed by a woman, but this was not the end of Samson. Well, not quite. 这个伟大的人，伟大的领袖。I don't know. May maybe the word "way da" is not a, a good way. It's the way it is. Great,、uh, because he made some really big mistakes. Okay, but anyway, he had been conquered. 被谁胜过吗 ？Okay, 啊，被一个菲利士女人。He was betrayed. To my betrayed by a woman, but this was not the end for Samson. This was not the end. 不不是最后最后的结局 Not quite. Not yet. When I write down here, not quite. It means that there still is a little bit more. There's still 还要做一件事情 and that's what our story today is all about. <clears throat> While he was in prison. He was in prison. He asked for one last favor. Now, of course, they didn't know it was going to be his last favor. But 他在监狱里，他就要求给他另外一个恩惠 ，a favor. Do something for me. Okay. Well, he didn't ask them. I'm not sure that they would give him too many favors, but God gave him a favor. He had let God and His people down. He had caused God was disappointed. 对他很失望 and the people 很失望 but he asked heaven. 他要求天国 I mean, he couldn't ask the Philistines, they're not going to give him any favors, but actually he did, and we'll see that in just a little bit. But he asked God, "Give me strength, just for one more time." Go on. Samson realized, 他意识到 that his time was over. 他的时间已经到了 I mean, he was in prison. He had no eyesight. He couldn't see.、Uh, I once saw a picture, a very sad picture. It was a terrible picture. And、uh, I thought, oh man, he was so strong, so handsome, 非常英俊 But then, in the end, blinded, in prison, weak. Samson realized that his Time was over, and he had made many mistakes. Yes, he had 做了很多错误 but he wanted one last chance to do something for his people. 他要求天国给他最后最后一个机会 
帮助他的子民 ，to help his people. Now the question is, would heaven listen? 会不会垂听啊 ？Would they listen? Would heaven? Would God do something for him? He prayed. 他祷告。He prayed that his strength would return for one last time. 他祷告说 ，God, give me strength one last time. 给我力量，最后最后一次，还是给我力量。Okay, for one last act. Okay, he's going to do one last thing. Hmm. Samson was given his last re- request. God gave him the strength. God gave him the strength. His strength returned, but the Philistines didn't know that. Philistines 不知道他的。力量回复。Now they had planned a great celebration. 他们有一个很大的庆祝，庆典。Okay, and、uh, they are going to hold it at their temple. 在他们的圣殿，他们神的这个圣殿。They wanted to thank their God. 感谢他们的神啊。That Samson had been captured. They wanted to thank their God that he had been captured. Going on, okay. This was to be a wonderful day. This was going to be a wonderful, 非常非常好玩的一天啊 They were going to. Show Samson off, 给给所有的非利士人炫耀 their enemy, 这个大敌人 Samson. So what's going to happen? Before we find out what's going to happen, we are going to have to look at some light on our path. Okay, now we come to some light on our path. We're going to look at、uh, this next text. Will be what shall we say? Sixteen, eighteen. Proverbs sixteen, eighteen. Yeah, that's a good one. 嗯，我们找到了箴言十六章十八节。十六章十八节这里说的非常好。Pride goeth before destruction, and a haughty spirit before a fall. 骄傲在败坏以先，黄心在跌倒之前。Okay, here we're we're talking about Samson. 嗯，参孙，艾老师，我要说的话啊，我读圣经的故事的时候，最早的我第一次接触圣经的时候，我读到参孙的故事。Wow. 我那个时候啊，还会哭嘞，我会觉得他好可怜呢、啊，被人家呃那样虐待啊。后来，后来呢，我不知道参孙他是做这个事，是做了很久，我以为他很快他就变成一个坏孩子。嗯，但是其实呃，你告诉我，参孙在这个事情之前，他有一段很好的日子，是不是 ？Right, twenty years. 嗯 ，twenty years. The Bible says that he was a judge for twenty years.、Mm-hmm. The the story is very racy, 很兴奋的，很啊，很那个戏剧化的。呃，戏剧化的 ，Yeah, it it is it's very racy. It's dramatic,、mm-hmm. 戏剧化的 ，dramatic. So we think that it's short, but actually. He was very effective for very a、uh, long, long time, but he still had a problem, and that he was what's this? Strong. He was strong. He 
depended upon his own strength, and unfortunately, he was weak in his what? 他的呃，他有他的弱点呐，他的欲望。Yeah, which was ladies, girls, 对 females, whatever. 美女，美女，美女，美女。So what we need to do is to keep in mind that the strongest, even twenty years, wow, twenty years, still strong people can be weak, and we need God's strength. 大家都非常兴奋地在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那边庆祝，在那They teased Samson that he wasn't able to do anything anymore. The chief of Tarsa, 哎呀，你什现在什么东西，什么事都不能做。So they were they were teasing him. Ah, and、uh, of course he couldn't even see what he was where he was going. 他根本是看不见东西啊。他的双眼已经没了。They weren't afraid of this enemy anymore. 他们根本不怕，根本不怕他们的敌人。Going on, but Samson had asked to be placed beside the pillars holding up the temple. Now. As as we all know, when you're building a big building, in the middle, your jutes, right? Pillars, jutes, and apparently, 好像 this temple, 这个他们他们的圣殿 this temple had two big pillars, 两个大的柱子 in the middle, and so. Samson said to them, "Oh, I'm I'm kind of tired,、uh, just a little bit tired. I I think I want to lean up against the pillars." Ah, so he was leaning up in the pillars, and all the long, all the while, he's feeling, "Oh, here's one pillar. Oh, here's another pillar. Okay, 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 okay," and then. In one last act of incredible, incredible, 很难以相信的这个力量 In one last act of incredible strength, he pushed against the pillars, and he pushed, and he pushed, and he pushed, and he pushed, and, he pushed, and brought the whole roof. Crashing down on everyone. This founding, ah, this wooding, came crashing down on everyone. The ancient tales, records, ah,、uh, in this record of the ancient tales, it says that Samson. Killed more of his enemies at his death than when he was alive. This is hard to believe because he was alive. I mean, he was this strong man. He was leading Israel for twenty years, and yet the ancient tales record 
他们的记载 record that Samson killed more of his enemies at his death. 他死的时候 of course, because he died with them. Everything crashed down. It crashed down on him. He killed more of his enemies at his death than when he was alive. Can you imagine that? When he died, he killed more people than he had killed for twenty years. What a story! It's a tragic story. Han Beitan di Gugusher. And the question I asked here is, what do we learn from all of this? Is there something that we can learn? My, I can think of several things. It's a sad story. Feitan Beitan de Iga Iga Gugusher. But there is much that we can learn. First of all. Going on, first of all, we need to keep in mind that these are real people, real stories, things that could happen to us. The things that happen to them, 我相信他所发生的事情 the things that happen to him could also happen to us. You say he wasn't very smart. 他不太聪明。难道我们所有的事情很聪明吗 ？Of course, sometimes we're not so clever, we're not so、um, wise in the things that we do. Okay, probably one thing that I wrote down here, and I'd like to leave with this. That we should not trust in our own strength. That to trust in our own strength is not enough. 如果我们是靠自己的力量，靠自己的聪明，完全依靠自己，这个还不够。What is the point? We need to trust. The God of Heaven. That was that was the lesson that I really learned. 我们要相信依靠啊、uh, 天国的所带领的 In fact, it says we must be true to the path of right. 这个真正的这个真诚的真正的这个道路。我们要 true to 中心语 In other words, if God tells us to go a certain direction, we need to go that direction. That even in defeat, 虽虽然他最后这个失败了 we can still have victory. Samson had victory. 还是在他失败的高潮的时候 he still had victory because God was willing to be with him right up to the end. Wow, what a story! Now stay by for some words you need to know. Okay, now for some words you need to know. Hmm, bringing down the house. First one is leader. 领袖或者是啊、uh, 那个就是呃、uh, 怎么说呢？组长啊，班长啊，领袖他是 leader. Yes, yes.、Mm-hmm. Actually, a leader has many 主管。主管对。Even, even could.、Uh, okay, okay. Now if You let someone down.、Mm. Let someone down. 就是
让那个人失望了 ，right？ 让某一个人失望 ，yeah， 另一个人失望。Mm. So, but we say to let down means to make somebody disappointed.、Mm. Is that right? 对 ，Okay, and then the, the、uh, Felicher and these Philistines they planned a great celebration. 庆祝，他们为了呃、uh, 庆祝的时候呢，就要羞辱参孙，是不是 ？That's right, right. In fact, in fact, the next one is you see, you can say he's 羞辱 Uh, they teased him, 欺负对 Okay, 欺负 Uh, sometimes we tease our younger brothers and sisters. Did you ever tease your little brother? 欺负。没有，没有，没有。我，那你真的是好人。我是好的姐姐。哦，好的姐姐。嗯。Okay. And then the last one we have here is a pillar. A pillar inside of a building. What is a pillar? 柱子。我想，呃，那种古罗马式的建筑物，那个柱子是很高、很粗的、很大的柱子。就是用那个柱子才能够支持那个房子，对不对 ？That's right, exactly.、Mm. So,、uh, a pillar, you can have many different kinds. Even modern houses have pillars,、mm. uh, but they they don't look like many many years ago.、Mm. I'm sure. Okay, well, I guess that's about all the time we have for words you need to know. Well, now we've come to the end of our lesson, and、uh, we've talked about many lessons that can be learned from the strongest man that ever lived. This is an old book, and it has strong men, it has weak men, and the strongest man who ever lived was also probably we could say the weakest man who ever lived. Wow, what a story! Well, in our next chapter, we're going to talk about why we're in a foreigner, a faithful foreigner, 很忠心的外国人 So, I hope you'll join us as we share another interesting story from ancient tales. See you then. That's all for today, and thanks for watching. If you like ancient tales for today, please visit atft.chinesehope.tv. You may also contact us by writing to ancienttalesfortoday@gmail.com. Again, that's ancienttalesfortoday@gmail.com. Tell your friends about ancient tales for today. See you next time.